ask me. I don't know why they keep sending me boxes, but here we are again with another Wizarding World Loot Crate box. If they had sent me boxes on a regular basis such as this last year, I'd probably still be subscribed to them, but uh, let's just get right into it. So, I don't know the theme of this box. I don't know anything. It just showed up, so we're going to figure it all out together. So these looks like this looks like Fox the Phoenix all over the box. So just set that to the side. Kind of, I don't know where to start. You saw that weird shelf in there. So I guess we'll just start with the t-shirt. Box is moving on its own. Speed into all the magic. So we have a t-shirt in a bag. Let's see what we got. Okay, so a cream colored t-shirt with an owl, which says owl post over the breast. So, and a, a v-neck t-shirt. Don't think I've had one of those in a long time. So be interested <laughs> to see how that looks. Um, but that's, that's basically all it is. Nothing on the back, just a plain t-shirt. So not bad. I kind of, I like to refer to it as undercover magic. So not bad. It's a Harry Potter t-shirt, but unless you look real close, you probably won't go. So not bad. I like it. It feels nice and soft. The quality of t-shirts and subscri in subscription boxes has really improved. And uh, this seems to be on that list. So not bad. Um, and then it seems we have another thing in a bag. I don't know if this is a pillowcase, but I guess we'll have to open it and find out. And I still don't know the theme. The theme was Al, that t-shirt said Al Post. So I don't know how this, oh, whoa. Okay, so it's like a, a Marauder's Map tea towel. And the good thing it told me on the tag that it was a tea towel. So that's that. Um, not bad. I don't mind it. I have actually purchased a set of uh, Harry Potter Wizarding World uh, tea towels before and the, I can see the same problem with this one that I had with those in that there's no like hook to like hang it on your drawer hangs or your drawer pulls. Um, so I don't ever use those because like what am I supposed to do? Just like throw this on the counter somewhere like I just it's too big too chunky like look at that thing I can't even fit it all in frame I have to back up really far for you to see the whole thing so while I don't dislike it I just feel like it's impractical for how I use towels in the kitchen so but I do like that it is Marauders map themed so not bad. I think the one I have is actually better. This one feels thinner and I don't know. I just, I don't know. Just doesn't feel as good. But then again, it came in a subscription box and those ones I paid retail for. Okay. And now we have a pin, which has the Hogwarts Express on it. It says platform nine and three quarters. I'm not even going to bother taking it out. I'm pretty sure you can see what it is two clasps on the back, nice and big. Not bad for a pin, um, you know, all those crazy pins that we get with all the colors and, and everything. So it's nice to have just plain old brass looking pin. And then we'll see what's in here. It's, it says Hogwarts Wax Seal. So I'm gonna look and see if I can open this thing find out what it looks like on the inside. I feel like I got a wax seal not too long ago. I think I have a few of them. Maybe somewhere around five wax seals, all from subscription boxes of various uh, different companies. So now that I was able to get that off, okay. So the box isn't bad. It feels nice and smooth. Let's see if we can get something out. So yeah. And it's pretty much the exact set that I always get. One piece of wax in that same uh, same shape. I don't know if this is like the 
the wax shape that you use for sealing letters and stuff, but they're always like this. And then we have kind of a plain Hogwarts logo. Let's see if I can get it out. Everything's always so hard. Everything wants to come out except for, okay, there we go. So let's see if you can see it. So it's just the crest with an H and it says Hogwarts. Um, none of the house animals, no, nothing special on it. So kind of boring as far as wax seals go. So this will join all my other wax seals and go live in the closet alone. And now, looks like we only have two items left. We'll save this shelf thing for the, for the, for the end because I don't quite know what it is. And now, up here we have a pack of postcards. So it looks like we have the Hogwarts Express. And what does that say? Ollivanders? Say that. Diagon Alley. So we got Ollivanders and Flourish and Blots and that just looks like, um, I don't know if you'll be able to tell, but the right there is Hagrid and Harry. So it just looks like a scene from the movie that they slapped a, a graphic on. And then we have Hedwig or the Alpost. I mean, that's Hedwig from the movie, but it says Alpost on it. And then greetings from Hogwarts. So, um, you know, regular, just postcard stuff on the back, nothing fancy. Not bad, I'm not, not really a postcard sender, but um, we'll see. I'm sure I can find some use for them. And then we will see what this is. Okay, so it is some sort of shelf. I'm gonna try to open this without crinkling too much. I don't know if that's going to be possible. Okay, so it, I can't tell, I don't think this is wood. It's probably some sort of medium density fiberboard or some sort of other product like that. I mean, it does have a texture to it. I guess I would not be totally surprised if it was wood, but I'm gonna go with its fiberboard. Doesn't tell me what it's made out of here. But so, so we have this or this or I don't know how it goes. But then on the end, it says the owl post. And then on the front, we have an owl flying. And then on the side, we have Hogwarts. And those are words written there, but I can't decipher any of them. And I don't know that I can decipher any of those words either. So I'm not sure if, if this is supposed to sit on your desk and you put like pens and pencils in it, or, I mean, that would make the most sense, right? Because here's the top, and then this, everything is geared for it to sit this way. And it, 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 it smells like wood. So maybe if it's not all the way wood, they may have parts that are made out of wood. This is just an, an odd item, I'll say that. I really wish this box would at least have some sort of card or something to be like, this is what this item is, especially on an item like this, like a pin. Okay, I can understand. I don't need to be explained what a pin is, but just odd. Okay, so we have the Alpost pencil holder. I guess I could throw some flowers in there, make a planner box, who knows? So the, that, we have some postcards. We have a Hogwarts train pin. We have a wax seal, um, the Alpost t-shirt, for some reason a Marauder's Map tea towel, and I think that's everything. So I guess Al the Alpost would be the theme. I mean, postcards, sealing letters, even though you don't need it for postcards, a holder for your stationery, I don't know what that would have to do with the Hogwarts Express, but that's what we're going with. Outpost or magical delivery or something along those lines. So uh, kind of kind of typical for a loot crate box. Some items I'm just not interested in, other items that are like, 
okay, I'm mildly interested in. It's it's rare that um, they hit home runs anymore. So I'll take what I can get, and uh, we'll see if another one shows up. I, I really have no idea. <laughs> so with that, see you next time. Bye.